It's always a, a you know, um, sad when someone of our, um, I guess, clan passes, and I wish his family well. And um, the great thing about what we do is, uh, hopefully, it lives on, and there's some posterity and some remembrance every time his, his uh, that beautiful mustache graces our screen. We'll, we'll, we'll remember Bert Reynolds. 82, right? Day that makes him. Um, but yeah, I mean, Boogie Nights is one of my favorite movies anyway, but uh, I mean, there was many that, uh, extraordinary actor, you know? And I, I never met the man, but I always heard he was a, he was a lovely human being, and uh, no, it's very sad, he was 82, but um, maybe he's up there tonight and he's uh, smiling down, hopefully, on, on us, you know, but it was quite sad to hear, you know? I mean, when anyone... The, the privilege of this career is that we get to we get to be in movies and we get to tell stories and there's a moment of our life that's captured forever and um, and you know when you lose somebody my grandfather was an actor for over 60 years and we lost him last year and it is incredible to get to go back and watch his old performances and and talk about these different stages of his life and to see him being 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, you know, 80. Like these are, this is a real gift. And um, and so, yeah, you know, I mean, I, I think that anyone who's in the arts, it's, it's you, you get to be a part of a, a legacy that is um, of storytelling that, that does last. And it is sort of, it does in a way give you an eternal life.